Hello everybody, today we're going to show you how to make these masks to prepare for a possible upcoming epidemic. So please make sure to read the disclaimer. So you're going to need some elastic, a pair of scissors, a chalk if you would like, some sewing pins, something to measure with, a thread of your choice, and then here is the pattern that you can print and cut out and the link is in the description box as well. Finally, you will need some fabric. So you're gonna start out by laying this fabric nice and flat, and you're going to fold this into fourths. Next, this line here represents the direction that the thread runs in in your fabric. So make sure you align those, and then you can secure the pattern to your fabric using these pins here. Next, you can grab your scissors, and basically you can cut out the outline of the pattern. Now you can just remove your pins, and this is going to leave you with four sheets of fabric. So you're going to split those into pairs, and you can also use some pins to secure each pair. Next, you can run over to your sewing machine, and you're just going to prep it using the thread of your choice. Now here is a pair, and basically you just have to make a seam along the long curve. And repeat this for the other one. So now we're going to open it up and basically you're going to flip it to the exposed side. So this thing here is called the seam allowance and you're going to go ahead and open that up nice and flat. So what we do is that we use an iron to get that really flat. Now this is optional, but it's really going to enhance the quality of your mask. So we're using this little cushion here. Now, we advise that if you do this, please be careful because we don't want any of our subscribers to get hurt. Now you can grab your scissors and you're going to make cuts along one centimeter increments, making sure not to pass that initial seam. And this is just going to make it easier to fold later and make sure to do this with the other pair. So now you're going to open this up and you're going to have the exposed side concave and then you're going to open the other one to have that convex. So you put them together, nice sides together, and then you're basically going to make seams along both of the long sides. Now that it's a tube, you can just open it up and then we're going to make another seam along the edge. Now this is just to give it more strength and it's basically going to give it a sort of hem as well. So now you have this short exposed side and we're just going to fold that over and then sew it as well. So do this for the other side and it's kind of like another hem. Hmm. Now you're going to take your elastic and you're going to cut out two 10 inch strips. Now lay these elastics flat along the edge and you're going to fold the fabric over it. And then you're also going to sew that to just secure it in place. So then you'll repeat this with the other side and you're going to have these exposed ends. So just sew them as well. And now here is the finished product. As you can see, it's very professional, it's very sturdy. And you can go ahead and place this over your face and over your ears. Now, what's so great about this mask is that it actually conforms to the edges of the face. So nothing's really leaking. And you can go ahead and use different colors, different fabrics, whatever you'd like. So we really hope you enjoyed this tutorial, but if you feel like you just want to watch the process being done a couple more times before you feel confident to try it, then go ahead and check out our video where we mass produce a ton of these masks to make sure that we are prepared in case anything happens. So the link for this video is going to be in the description box down below. So thank you so much for watching this video. Please make sure to like, comment, and subscribe. And thank you. Bye, guys.